What's up you guys, this is Jay Younger 2 back with another video and in this video today I'm going to be discussing the truth about Chris Middleton. But before this video starts, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications for more basketball videos every week. Let's get into it. Chris Middleton is a very interesting NBA player personally. You know Chris Middleton, he's from where I'm from in South Carolina, he's not too far away in Charleston but looking at Chris Milton and the overall narrative about him many people are very confused on where they want to place Chris Middleton as a player some people are saying this year you should put more props on his name but then you have others who are you know putting him down because of his inconsistency and well he is a great player in my opinion I don't think he's really a star shoot he's not even close to being a superstar caliber player but on a really good day, Chris Middleton can play like your second option. But the other night against the Phoenix Suns was just another example of his inconsistent play at times. You know, Giannis Antetokounmpo scored 20 points, I believe, in the fourth quarter. And Chris Middleton and Drew Holiday had 28 points combined compared to Giannis's 42 points he had in that game. Looking at that game, if those two contributed even more and they weren't trying to give Drew Holiday so many shots as well, and you know, and Chris Middleton can actually hit his shots, this t game two would have been totally different for the Milwaukee Bucks. But from what I'm saying right now, Giannis is the only player really doing anything. But for me personally, you know, I like Chris Middleton. I think Chris Middleton is a very solid NBA player. You know, his numbers have definitely gone up the past two seasons for the Milwaukee Bucks. He's been playing in a lot of games. He's doing his part. He is playing like a second option level player. But he's not a guy who I think you could really rely on to be your second guy and win an NBA championship. He does have the ability to hit clutch shots. He has the ability to play when it matters the most. And he definitely proved that a lot when he against the Brooklyn Nets in that series, despite him still having certain inconsistency at times. But overall, Chris Middleton is still a great player. He's an all-star. But the most important thing about Chris Middleton is that in order for the Milwaukee Bucks to even win, he is the key for them to win an NBA championship. If he's not playing good, we all know the results and outcomes of games for the Milwaukee Bucks. They lose. And it's nothing really against Drew Holiday. Drew Holiday is an amazing, great talent in the NBA. He's one of the best defenders in the league as well. But when, you, when in terms of offensive play and the guys who can really step up at those moments, it's Chris Middleton that who the Bucks need to constantly play consistent in order for them to win and to come back in the series against the Phoenix Suns. Because the way it's looking right now in this series against the Suns, the Suns are just dominating them. Markel Bridges is just dominating them. DeAndre Ayton is doing what he wants. Chris Paul, Devin Booker. Everybody on the Phoenix Suns right now is doing what they want and they let Jay Crowder get more buckets last night as well so looking at this phoenix suns team they're on pace to in my opinion win this series in five to six games that's only if the milwaukee bucks finally come out and win these next two home games in this series but looking at chris middleton he's going to have to be that guy for this team who steps up and has an even bigger game three a game four and possibly for the rest of the series on how long it lasts we saw what he did at the end of the series against the atlanta hawks and helping that team close out that series but also that Brooke Lopez played a big part in that role as well helping the Bucks win in that series so really you know for Chris Middleton he's gonna have to step up even more I'm gonna have to expect to see way more from him in game three but not only him but Drew Holiday those two guys as I said before they are really the key in the, the Bucks winning this series alongside Brooke Lopez as well he plays another pretty big role because we've seen what he can still do as well and looking at the Milwaukee Bucks, they were expected. I, I picked the Bucks to win this series in six games. But the way it's looking, if the Bucks do come back and tie this series, it can go, you know, possibly seven games. I think this series could also be a series where home court advantage definitely plays a big part in it. But looking at the Milwaukee Bucks, you know, they can't re solely rely on Giannis to do everything. Giannis, you know, he had a big night the other night. But, you know, you can't expect him to play hard and a lot and expect the team to just still win games. Because looking at this modern NBA now, you know, a guy can put up a lot of points. I mean, Devin Booker, for crying out loud, put up 72 points. But guess what? They still lost that game. Even LeBron, when he goes to the NBA Finals and he's dominating, those teams 
that he's been previously on in the Cavaliers, they still lost. And the same goes for Giannis and him dropping 40 plus points and still expecting the team to win. It just won't happen because of the way the game is today. So for Chris Middleton, you know, many people, you know, have talked about his inconsistencies and all of these things about him. And I believe that Chris Middleton on a really good day can play like a star level player, but I still think he is just a great player. This year in the playoffs, he's averaging, you know, 23.1 points, eight rebounds, five assists. And those are really good numbers. Those are great numbers for a player. But, you know, and he's proven himself to be a closer for this Milwaukee Bucks team. Without Giannis or not, he's still a great closer. He can finish in the clutch. So overall, looking at Chris Middleton, I believe that Chris Middleton is a great NBA talent. I believe that Chris Middleton, as I said before, when he's consistent, he's a star. He's a player that who can be one of the, your best players on your team. But when he's very inconsistent and he doesn't play to that level like how he should, we don't put him in that same category anymore. But yeah, man, in order for the Milwaukee Bucks to win this series, Chris Middleton and, the, and Drew Holiday both need to step up. That's it. Because, well, Giannis, and if they don't get this situation right, Milwaukee, we may be seeing some changes around here. But yeah, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more basketball content each and every week. Have a good day. Peace.